It's Women's Month and let's talk about Remedios Gomez. She's better known by her nom de guerre, Commander Liwayway. Remedios was born in Mexico, Pampanga in 1919. As a teenager, she was a girly girl. She loved making dresses, wore perfume, and participated in local beauty pageants. When the Japanese invaded the Philippines, her father, Basilio Gomez, who served as the vice mayor of her hometown, organized a resistance force. He was captured and tortured by the Japanese. His body was put on display for the town to see. This traumatic event inspired Remedios to join the Hukbong Bayan Laban sa Hapon, or Huk Balahap, in 1942 at the age of 22. When she first joined, she was assigned as a nurse, but she quickly rose up the ranks and was promoted to commander of her own military squadron. She became Commander Liwaiwai. 10% of the fighters of the Huk Balahap during World War II were women. During the war, Remedios led battles in Pampanga, Tarlac, and Zambales. Her team rescued American pilots whose planes were forced down. She was known for wearing her best dress in battle, as in, parang pupunta siya ng party. And she wore bright red lipstick. Nga naman, kung malapit na katapusan, dapat maganda ka. She was captured twice by the Japanese, but both times narrowly escaped execution. After the war, Remedios returned underground because she did not accept the new Philippine democracy. She married another rebel leader, Bani Paraiso, and they fled to the Visayas in 1948 as part of the Hukbalahap Expansion Force. That same year, Bani died in battle and Remedios was captured. This was the end of her journey as Commander Liwaiwai. I couldn't find much about her family except for her younger brother Oscar, who joined her in the Hukbalahap as a guerrilla, and another brother, Andrew, who in 2009 wrote her biography called Commander Liwaiwai. Remedios Gomez Paraiso died in 2014 at the age of 95 after a lifetime of fighting for military pensions and the recognition of the contributions of women as heroic combatants in war. Bakit kaya wala pang pelikulang buhay niya? O diba?